what's up people welcome to black ceo my name is kalaluka and as always welcome to today's video i hope you all are having a wonderful day as for me this is when we just clock morning it is eight o'clock in the morning i'm just from doing three hours of reach out and client calls and i have got two successful meetings coming up immediately after i'm done shooting this video so i want to make this snappy so i can go have those meetings and sign those two clients but otherwise, you need to wish me luck in order to sign them successfully. And I will let you know in the next video if I sign those clients successfully or not. In this video, I'll be talking about the six ways of which you can make money without having money. In short, the businesses that you can start up right now without any money. The first business model that you can start without having any startup capital is freelancing. Freelancing includes different services on the internet from video editing, thumbnail editing, copywriting and just doing various services for businesses on the internet. With all the modules of freelancing, they all come with their own perks and benefits. There are certain services in freelancing that produce a lot of money and there are certain works in freelancing that also brings in little money. So it's up to you to scale them up accordingly so that you know which model in freelancing works best for you but in case freelancing isn't for you shall i dive on to my next one which is consulting with consulting you would need a specific skill set right you would need specific skills in order to tell people on what to do on specific topics it doesn't really matter what you know how to do whether it's knowing how to edit videos knowing how to run a successful smma knowing how to create content on youtube and knowing how to create thumbnails for youtube videos as well as knowing how to optimize social media all of those sets of knowledge you can use them in consulting finding consulting clients is not a very daunting task because people are literally looking for new information and knowledge every single day if i woke up one morning and said i wanted to learn how to edit videos wholeheartedly I would go directly on Upwork, right? Or maybe even on YouTube, but it's highly unlikely. If somebody really wants real knowledge, some knowledge that was gotten from a fellow human being, they would go to websites like Fiverr or Upwork.com. And instead of reaching out to the professional video editors, thumbnail editors who do that for a living because hell, they are really busy. How can they take time out of their day to help you prepare for your own editing? They would charge you a lot of money. That's where you come in as somebody who's doing consulting full time. You don't have to be running an SMMA. You don't have to be running an editing campaign. You don't need to be running Facebook ads. You don't need to be editing YouTube videos for a living. All you would need to do is know how to do those specific skills. And people would come to you with the hunger, with the thirst to learn how to do what you know how to do. And just like that, you can charge people even $100 an hour per consulting call, which can generate you a lot of revenue. Because I've seen people who make 10K a month just on consulting alone. But of course, these people also have digital marketing agencies. So they are making up to $50,000 a month. But what I'm trying to tell you is consulting also brings in a lot of money, which is why he still keeps it as a side hustle. Third service on my list is cleaning services. I know these are certain services that you may not even want to hear about. There are certain services that your mom would even recommend you to do at home. But with cleaning services, I know somebody in Kenya who cleans bins for a living, right? He goes house to house and then asks for those trash cans which are really dirty it cleaning them is a daunting task you go there all you have to invest in is maybe a power hose the one which is used for washing cars yes that would cost money but hell how much money compared to running a full-on business you invest in a power hose and then you charge each household 50 dollars to hose down their bin and of course they would need their bin holes down every single week so if you're working with, for instance, let's say 25 houses and each house is paying you $50 per week, already you are making a thousand, a thousand, $1,250 a week. And it doesn't end there. The more clients that you have, the more that revenue just keeps on skyrocketing. And there is no household out there that can shy away from paying $50 per week just to have their dustbin cleaned. It is a daunting task, 
and they know that it might be somewhat stressful for you but if you know how to do business the correct way and you watch my videos you will know exactly how to go about it and actually profit very well from this and if you're making $1,250 a week hell it means you're making up to what's that times four that's equal to five thousand you're making five thousand dollars a month you're making half of ten thousand dollars a month just from washing bins just from washing trash cans and just like that you can leverage your business and actually start investing in other business models that actually require more prestige maybe you won't feel comfortable with washing dustbins forever fourth business model that i would want you to try is social media management it is a skill in on its own to learn and kind of nurture but social media management is something that is really needed, especially in the business world. If you know how to manage social media accounts, especially for influencer brands, companies, e-commerce brands, you are actually eye candy. You are, you are very attractive to the market. Company owners and influencers will actually look at you as treasure for their social media accounts. And it's not even that hard. Working with social media management is basically just uploading content to their social media on a consistent basis and hell if you know how to use social media obviously you know how to post you know how to use hashtags and you can learn on small courses how to do seo and actually how to use hashtags in a proper manner so it's actually not a very daunting task actually you can do social media management for even up to two hundred dollars a month and that can work out i don't know if you find higher paying clients you can even do it to up to a thousand dollars a month which is kind of dope the fifth business model that you would likely be interested in venturing into would be a virtual assistant and no being a virtual assistant doesn't mean you have to be a computer or an ai or an automated robot even you yourself as a human being can be an assistant to a brand or a company who is still standing on two legs. There are several companies out there who are not yet big and who are very low on staff. All you would need to do is prove that you are smart enough to work with the boss as an assistant. In future, I would like to make videos on actually how to reach out to these people and ask for these jobs because mostly what's in your head right now is oh I'm, i just graduated high school i only have a high school certificate i don't have a degree all of that stuff does not matter when you're a virtual assistant what you're basically doing is assisting a company owner or a ceo with retrieving information about what's going on in the company and actually helping them schedule meetings actually helping them talk to clients and interact and other than it just being a profitable source of income it actually helps you get more skilled in the field that you want to accomplish i would even recommend being a personal assistant to a business model that you would want to start sometime in the future that would actually equip you with the right set of knowledge in order to run your business successfully because you are working hand in hand with somebody who's already running a somewhat successful business so it would actually be a head start for you you would get your feet wet in the industry and last but not least, the sixth business model that you can start right now without any money is personal training. I believe I've talked about personal training sometime in the past in one of my videos where all you need to do is go and sign up at the gym. Hey, this does not apply to anyone. You cannot become a personal trainer if you yourself is overweight or underweight. You need to actually have a somewhat good looking and attractive physique that people would want you don't need to be Braun Strowman you don't need to be the Rock Johnson in order for you to be a personal trainer all you would need to do is even just have a six-pack right get down do crunches have a nice body and then go sign up to be a personal trainer and you can even market in that same gym because most of the time people who go to the gym have intentions of losing weight and if you just put them on the gym floor they won't even know which equipment to use first which is where you come in. You as a personal trainer is supposed to show the overweight person or the person who wants to get buff which machines to use. And you can charge even like, I don't know if you live in African countries, but if you live in the European, the American countries, you can even charge up to $100 per session. The pricing does not concern me, right? You're the personal trainer. You yourself is going to decide what is best for you and your business. And believe me, I have made these calculations in the past, right? All these business models that I've told you right now are capable of generating you up to $10,000 a month. 
and I also started from personal training. I might even go back and continue personal training because other than it being a professional business venture, it actually has good advantages for your own personal health, your own body. It will force you to go to the gym and work out even when you don't want to because you're getting paid to work out. And that's basically it for today's video. Those are the six different business models that you can start without any money or investment. Of course, there is no complete business that you can start without any investment because in all of these you would need time and you would need concentration, you would need focus. And all of those things come at a price that is more expensive than money. Now that you know how to make money without having money, go out there and make 10K a month. Comment under this video if any of these strategies was helpful for you. And as always, I'll be watching from afar and I'll be rooting for you.